hi guys in this video i'll be sharing with you a wonderful business idea you can start with a very little capital it's a local delivery service business how do you go about this business you can do it with or without owning a bike or a vehicle first you need to register your business with the corporate affairs commission in nigeria go online to look for um, their offices in your state to register a business name you can't spend more than thirty thousand the name is about um, twenty thousand and then you're going to spend a little bit above that due to name search and other little expenses while waiting for your business name to be approved because it's going to take about two weeks or above even a month it's the best time for you to start creating means of advertisements for your business so you need to open a facebook business page you need to get an instagram account because these are the places you're going to advertise your business this now how do you go about this business without owning a bike or a vehicle now my business is an online business and i always require the services of a delivery agent most times the delivery companies are always completely booked out if you don't give them your orders on time you when you call them they're not going to have time for you sometimes they don't even have enough dispatch riders I once ordered an item in Lagos and it was delivered to me by a delivery guy without a delivery bike so when I asked he said that he has other colleagues they're working for a company they deliver items in Lagos without a bike so I took his phone number so he could help me make some deliveries within Lagos and in fact the guy was fully booked when I called him he gave me um, the phone number of his colleague that one did a delivery for me just once and after then they were already booked in fact they were booked by vendors that they were sure of making deliveries for on daily basis because most businesses are now online people will always make use of delivery services before your business name gets ready you can go to some delivery companies and ask them to give you some of their jobs they can give you some of their jobs to handle even without a bike and then you give them um, some commission they'll be happy to do that you also need to contact some stores around you like the pharmacies boutiques supermarkets most of them will need the services of a delivery agent let them know that this is what you do and that you can deliver without a bike you don't have a bike but you can deliver so if you have a bike it's also an added advantage they'll give you some of these jobs before giving them your prices calculate how much it's going to take for you to use um, a taxi to deliver an item from the vendor's location to the customer and then you'll be able to add little amount on it you have your profit sometimes most of the deliveries will fall in one area so you're going to have more profits that way if you do this by the time your business name is ready you've already gotten a customer base and the most important thing in this business is reputation and security first reputation if people can count on you if these vendors can count on you that you always keep to your word you always keep to your time they will always keep using you and they wouldn't want to try out other delivery services if you tell them that i'm coming at this time make sure you you'll be there at that time in fact always give them a time um, frame when you'll be able to make these delivery services so that if you can't meet up this time they'll be able to use someone else and still keep you as a customer trust is very important in business therefore security when you're delivering items you have to be sure that the customers are sending you text messages even the vendor has to give you a text message of where this item is going to the person's phone number the address and everything each time I contact a delivery company that I have been using, they'll still ask for a text message. They're always like that. It, no matter how many times you've used them, they're definitely going to ask for a text message because this is an evidence. This is the same text message they're going to give to their um, dispatch riders. You need to um, learn more security measures about this business. You need to call the customer before taking off to be sure that the customer is available because most times these customers don't take their calls. Somebody might order an item and by the time you get there they're not taking calls so you lose because you've already wasted your floor or you've already wasted your transportation fare getting there. So you just have to be careful and you need to know the areas that are safe around you to make these deliveries. So this is a very wonderful business and if you have anything to ask, any questions to ask, let me know and drop your comments in the comment section. Thank you very much. Bye.